a frightened dog in the open sea, was looking for salvation 217 kilometers from the shore. At first, people could not believe their eyes. An oil platform located 217 kilometers from the shore in the waters of the Gulf of Thailand became the site of an unusual incident. In April 2019, workers noticed a strange object in the sea, which upon closer inspection turned out to be an animal's head, similar to a dog's. It sank into the water, then reappeared on the surface. The workers could not believe their eyes, how could a dog end up so far from land? However, it really was a dog. How events unfolded further, how the animal ended up in the open sea, and whether its owners were found, we will tell you all about this below. The exhausted animal barely made it to the platform, and climbed onto the metal beams under the drilling rig with difficulty. The waves washed over the dog, leaving it sitting chest deep in water. The wet and tired animal looked exhausted. The workers were wondering how to lift it onto the platform. We only saw its head, and if the waves had been bigger, we wouldn't have noticed it at all, recalls worker Han Vitasak. It was decided to tie a rope loop around the dog and lift it up. No one was sure that the operation would be successful, but they managed to carry out their plan on the first try. The trembling and frightened dog was lifted to a safe place. The dog didn't bark or make a sound, apparently, it had no strength left. But it didn't trust the rescuers either, it wouldn't let them pet it. However, seeing a bucket of water in front of it, it immediately plunged its muzzle into it and drank almost half of it. It is unknown how long the animal spent in the salty sea water. Gradually, the dog got used to people, allowed itself to be petted and began to eat. The workers identified its breed, Aspen, and gave it the nickname Bunrod, which in Thai means spiritual alms for good luck. However, there was a problem with the new team member, according to safety regulations. Animals are not allowed on the drilling platform. The workers decided to weld a cage to keep the dog in it, until it could be transferred to the shore. They contacted a tanker that was soon to return to the port. The dog spent two days on the platform, during which time the workers looked after it and fed it. The animal regained its strength and became friendlier. On the third day, the cage with the dog was loaded onto a passing ship heading to the port of Songkla in southern Thailand. The dog was taken to the shore. There, volunteers from the Animal Aid Fund met it and took it to the veterinary clinic in Songkla. Despite the ordeal, the dog appeared to be healthy, except for dehydration and exhaustion. Many wondered how the animal ended up in the open sea. Some believed that the dog had escaped from cruel owners. Perhaps she was trying to escape persecution. However, there are inconsistencies in this version. The Bangkok press suggested that the dog fell into the water from a fishing boat, which is more plausible. She was lucky that the sea was calm that day. Small waves allowed people to notice the dog's head. The breed also played a role in her survival. Aspens are a cross between several breeds, including street mongrels known for their endurance. Not all dogs can swim, but Boonrod proved that his breed can. Volunteers were never able to find Boonrod's owners, perhaps he was homeless. One of the workers expressed a desire to take the dog that everyone had become accustomed to. He did so after the end of his shift. This story had a happy ending, the dog found a home.